but now but now I have to edit that out because well you could just be like beep, yeah. and beep it while he's beep. And so, so apparently the curtains <laughs> I don't know if it's going to be this week or uh, or next week but apparently the curtains going to look real nice real soon awesome so how do you guys feel about opening said curtain I feel we fan freaking feel it nice. let's grab it just to open peel it back oh, so lightweight yep <laughs> <laughs> Popcorn. Oh yeah. Put, put oh, we'll the dim the lights first. first. Oh, d- oh wait, hold on. I got. I got. Ready? 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 ready yeah, yeah, ready, yeah. Ready, okay. <laughs> got, oh, got don't shit. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> don't shit. Yes. Popcorn <laughs> from the earth. Yep. From I'll put the butter the on. Earth. And uh, this is PlayStation VR theater. Midnight Gamescast. We record every Monday night at midnight, and then we bring it to YouTube every Tuesday as the weekly wrap up. That was yesterday. It was yesterday. pretty good. I complained a lot, but you know, not yeah. complaints. Crit- well, complaints. If you know yeah, me, complain. you're used to it by now. Every yeah. Wednesday, that's this right here. PlayStation VR Theater. We sit around, we hang out, we watch some trailers, we laugh, we cry. Snuggle up. PlayStation. I like snuggling quite a bit, sir. Me too, Lord, madam. And every Thursday as viewer takeover, but don't worry about that show. That's tomorrow. tomorrow. It's so far away. You got nothing to worry about. Twenty four hours. Beat up. Let's mm-hmm. watch some trailers. As always, I'm Brian. That's Jeremy. And this is Michelle. We want to thank and the squeaky chair <laughs> and the squeaky, and the squeaky chair. chair. As That's we true. turn, uh, hey, uh, hey, game cats. Meow. Meow. Listen, uh, last week uh, we, we recorded. Strangely, it was like super late. Wicked. And then we went super long. We're all real tired. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I totally forgot to thank our little game cat, RIP RPH, yeah. for, for uh, sending us all those trailers. As always. Uh, so, yeah. and, and he yet again sent us a ton of trailers this week. Uh, a, good, a good crop of trailers. Yep. I do say good so much. Good crop of trailers. Mm-hmm. Yep. Absolutely. Uh, make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. Uh, but I if you already too. subscribed, don't click it again. Yeah, don't. then you'll unsubscribe. Oh, no. that, that won't work at all. It's the end. purpose. <laughs> yeah. right. So what do you guys think? Should we dive directly into the first trailer? Fucking which dive. Joe Monahan actually yes. suggested this one. He's um, mentioned that more than once. Multiple times. Yeah. He was actually getting a little angry that we hadn't done it yet. <laughs> He's like, why haven't you yeah. this one's This one's a request from Joe Monahan. The rest will be from RIPRPH. This one's called Bullet Sorrow. So let me make sure the volume's down. Yep, yeah, it is. Final Thank you. Trailer. Yep. Look at that, I was like all prepared. Oh, thank you. Yep. This definitely looks fast paced. It reminds me for some reason, remember fear? Yeah, I do. Yeah. It has a fear look to it. Yeah. Those two guys. Controllers. Cross platform, that's pretty neat. So that ups the ante with uh, like getting parties together to play. Yeah, definitely. That always so you're just gonna shoot Ooh, him in the back I of the thought, head. Yeah, I thought it was yeah. I don't I don't know why out. they showed it, it probably glitched. <laughs> Oh Deep. shit! Right with high heels, they're gonna fight. Very glossy people. Titties. Very glossy. Yeah. <laughs> Astro glides back. Right. Shadow army. Shadow army. Ooh, they should have like called them titty army. They're scary titties. Right. They are scary. <laughs> yeah, I was I was really like hoping for story. I was hoping for aim support, but then I see all these like dual wielding. Yeah, this. Yeah, no. Oh shit! What is that? Oh, oh somebody with crazy hair. Titty lady. Yes. <laughs> Stop jumping the bullet sorrow gun. Yes. Looks fast paced and interesting. Yeah. Sounded better in my head. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Everything does. Yeah. Yeah. Go, sir. Thank you. Uh, bullet sorrow. Uh, well, so I feel like there's a lot of these types <clears throat> of games on the way. Right? Yes. We've, we've talked about a lot, but none of them have actually come out yet. No. So it's right. just like the whole horror game conversation we have every week. Yeah. Where it's there's like, there's a lot of them. There's so many shooters. There? There's a lot of them, but they're not here yet. <laughs> well, like, yeah. there's a lot of trailers for them. A lot of trailers <laughs> for shooters. Right. Yeah. So, like, so Bullet Sorrow, did this do anything different than all of the other gun games we've seen? I feel, I, you know, just because of Joe, I want to say yes. But I know, I mean, it still looks good. It looks tight. If I could say, it I don't said know it why. It contains a full story. Graphics story. look a little That's bit good. better. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. It's if got cross-platform multiplayer, which is more than the others do. It seems mm-hmm. right, right. Yep. Um, multiplayer support as well. Yeah, PvP. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's got a lot to it. Something that a lot of people have been asking for. Yeah, you know, we've just been hoping for that Farpoint patch. Yeah, We're like hey, just we've already got a great game. Just let us kill each other now. Yeah, uh, and uh, and other games are apparently taking up the mantle for that. Yeah. What was that other game? Those two, um, like. <laughs> Swedish and dudes were talking about we're bringing this game and special it was forces. That that seems like it's oh. trying to go a little above and beyond this. This seems like uh, um, 
don't know, a little less ambitious version of that, Bulletstorm. But, you know, it seems like whatever they're going after can be achieved easily. The other Bullet guys Star. are going after Bulletstorm. Yeah, Bulletstorm's a whole other game. Did I call it Bullets? Yeah. Yeah. But that's a game. That was a game. It's not a VR game. With the whole whip thing. <clears throat> nope. Laser whip. I think Bullet you're Storm combining that. games is, now. Is that Bulletstorm? Yeah. Really? I've yeah. Ne- I never played Bulletstorm. Bulletstorm, you could like lash on them and like whip them up in the air and it's kind of be slow and you'd be duh, 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 shoot them things. Okay. It'd be like calling like dick shits. I, there's a lot of vulgar language yeah, in that was game. Was that like a Gearbox game? What was that? I thought it was Gearbox yeah. or one of those games. Uh, I mean, developers, but yeah. Right. So, um... <laughs> anyway. Anyways, <laughs> Bullet Sorrow. Bullet okay. Sorrow. Yeah. Um... I don't know. The, so the only movement we saw was teleportation. Mm-hmm. Right. right. Since we saw different types of guns, we saw like something that looked like an uh, would be perfect for aim, and then we saw stuff that would be perfect for move control. Well, yeah. Definitely move controller as well. Yeah. Yeah. So like, so are they going to pull like an Arizona Sunshine and find an interesting way to let us play with both, yeah. or are we just right. going to be stuck with the move controllers? Hmm. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Can't tell from that trailer. Yeah, the the, uh, the teleportation is is a little disconcerting just because I'm Curious tired. Curious what of the story is going to be like. Teleportation. Too. Yeah, yeah. Is, yeah. It, is it is it going to be like a, a Half Life thing where you just well as you're walking around like stuff's happening or is it going to be like cutscenes? Right. I, I kind of yeah. hate cutscenes in VR. Yeah. Like I've never said I hated cutscenes until VR came around and then. Yeah. And then it's like, well, something that actually pulls you out of the action, like, yep. pull, like takes control away from you. Yeah. It's a lot worse when you're sitting there in first person. You think you're in the game, and suddenly you're like, oh. yeah, yeah. Oh. I'm watching this. <laughs> right. Yeah. 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 So yeah. hopefully they implement the story in a immersive way. Yeah. yeah. We'll we see. Shall see. Uh, Joe. Uh, point. Joe, I want you to know, and don't worry, I didn't, I didn't ignore you. I want, I want <laughs> Joe to tell us what about this game intrigued you yeah he he's looking forward to this because it time. looks good and i yeah. think it's actually it might be out on other on pc vr platforms mm-hmm. and it's gotten good reviews i could be wrong on that i could be mistaking it for another game all right we don't research that much no um, but we want to know why this game stood out for you mm-hmm. yeah sir yeah how much um <laughs> <laughs> weren't you the one that 25 brought this up? 25 yeah 24.99 yep I'm honestly, I'm thinking twenty nine, twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah. Definitely on the higher yeah. end. I, yeah, I'm feeling that game one. Game with story too. Even if I don't know if it's gonna be worth it or not, that's what they're gonna throw that on there. Twenty nine ninety nine. I don't want to do this. I'm, I'm gonna say this is gonna be an expensive one. Thirty nine ninety nine. Oh shit! Yeah. I'm betting because it has a good reputation on PC. Yeah. I'm betting that since they're putting so much into it. Yeah. I, I'm betting it's gonna be forty bucks. Right. Uh, and uh, and hopefully it'll be worth it. There you go. Cool. Right. Yeah. All right. A lot of people online just want to say that real quick, Dave. If compared it to like this, looks like a time crisis game. Mm-hmm. But I think okay. it, with the freedom of movement, uh, I think this is a little has a little more time going crisis. Than that. Yeah, time crisis had a lot of branching off. So if you did like two players, you could one could go this way, you could go that way. Yeah. And, but it was still on rails. Right. Yeah. Yeah. This it looks like you have a lot more freedom than that. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. All I right. think time crisis two is a great game. Uh, time crisis two. Three, four, true. But they were got they were really short campaigns after a while. There, there's some other good ones actually. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> and oh, oh, oh wow, Chrome this one. Gun. I don't know. Chroma gun. You think it's gonna flip? If you do this and then that, a little, a little, a little of that action. Pew. Yeah. A little, back. a little bit of this. A little bit. <laughs> of that. Be more like John. I think we should all be more like John. Oh, right. John who though? John Voight. John Denver. John Denver. John Lennon. You put the I mean, it's, imagine. Imagine this. Imagine Cake. That. Imagine there no country. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. John Lennon. That's who it is. Hey there. You look like a smart. So guy. this. Uh, uh, for it. <laughs> to our newest piece of paint um. Yeah, it looks like Portal, right? Oh, one hundred percent aperture. I mean, don't they reference it's it a, at the end? Even at the end. Portal yeah. Inspired shooter. Definitely. It totally is, but I want to say poorly. At least with oh, wow. the that's guy. That, no, not not the game. I think the game is going to be fun. Uh-huh. I just think the dude that's trying to be, uh, you know, Simmons, Jay Simmons, or oh, okay. Jay, whatever's, you know, that the actor. He's really good. He's trying to mimic him. Okay, I got you. 
and it oh, ruined the trailer for me. And I hope they don't do that through the whole game. Plus, they took away, and with his funniness, just showed you more stick figure action than actual gameplay. So, yeah, stick figures I could do without. Um, I, I get they're trying to convey that this game has a sense of humor. Yes. Uh, and at the end, of course, they do reference Aperture Labs. Yeah. Uh, you know, no affiliation with. Yeah. They beep it out, right? Yeah, they do beep it out. Um, yeah. I mean, it's a lot happening here with stick figures. There's a lot. This is this is a trailer of stick figures. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Like and, Island. Die alone on an island. Uh, yeah, is that what negativity. they said? <laughs> yeah. 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 And then you know, the game itself, I think, could be really fun. Uh, the game itself could be a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, it's it's already out on PlayStation Four, uh, as a as. Is a, this the one that they haven't made into VR yet? They have. I mean, it's they're, they're So the last thing we heard was, I think, maybe last week at best mm-hmm. uh, the developers were like oh yeah we definitely are we're definitely bringing this over to PlayStation VR we don't have a set release date you can probably expect it by the end of 2017 right. and everyone is like huh, that sounds a little ambitious yeah. considering right. it's September yeah yeah you know so uh, we'll we'll see when yeah, it so actually when are comes they gonna out they're going to do it yeah, yeah. 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 We're, everyone's betting i mean early 2018 at best right uh, the game's already made it's out on PlayStation 4 uh, it's getting decent reviews mm-hmm. uh, but this is one of those like I think um, along the lines of uh, what's coming out next month the Solus Project oh yeah where it got like average <clears throat> reviews outside of VR but in VR you're gonna be like this is this is fantastic yeah right yeah. well it's yeah, completely but, different yeah so yeah, oh. think of the, how great that would be playing Portal and Portal 2 in VR <laughs> right <laughs> yeah no that would everything be fantastic everything is better in VR <laughs> <laughs> yeah and it, I mean and, and I saw I watched the first maybe Five ten minutes of the game, yeah, uh, and you just you walk around, and that gun that you have is uh, you basically shoot colors, okay, all right, and then there's these balls that it's are like a paint gun, like a paint yeah. gun, yeah, mm-hmm. and there's these balls that are in your way, mm-hmm. and and you to to move the balls, you have to shoot sections of the wall that are paintable, okay, and the ball will move toward that section of the wall. It's totally a puzzle game. Like there's right. Right. It doesn't look like there's anything else going on. You go from room to room and it's just puzzle, 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 puzzle. Okay. Right. Uh, so I'm I'm curious to know like if there's a story that picks up, if yeah. the uh, if the narrator uh, you know is gonna be like GLaDOS funny. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Obviously that's what they're going for. Oh, yeah, but they, those were funny. <laughs> right. right. Yeah. Uh, and we'll see. Like it's hard to convey your sense of humor in a in a trailer. Yeah it is. Yeah. yeah. So I have faith in this one but We'll, we'll see, see what happens. Uh, right. uh, yeah. well, I like puzzle games, so yeah. hopefully it'll do a little justice. Yep. And this one, since it's already out on PlayStation 4, I think, God, I don't want to put a price on it because I forgot to look how much it is. Oh, uh, nice. Yeah, uh, but so let's let's call this one the VR patch or the VR DLC. Mm. Okay. How much would you pay to add VR to a game that you already have? So if that's if it's uh, going to be a standalone, you think, I, or it's going to be a I don't patch. know. Everybody's doing it different ways. How do we want to gear this price point? Let's as start with the patch. A patch? You've got a game that you like? $9.99. $9.99 for the patch to make the game you already bought VR. Or $14.99. $9.99. What do you think? I'm going, I'm going nine ninety nine, but I don't think they're going to do that. Okay, what do you think? Or maybe they'll give you the option. Maybe it'll be the uh, maybe they'll be the game and uh, the VR patch bundled, right? Uh, if they did that, I want to up my price point. Well, they give you the option. Like, well, you already bought this game. Yeah, right. and then they're like, oh, you haven't bought this there game. You go. Right. So, yeah, you know, you get to, you get you get both. You bought audiences. it. You have VR. Here yep, you go. Absolutely. Yep. So I'm saying ten bucks for the patch, and uh, I'm I don't know how much the game is. I think it's like twenty bucks. Okay. So you know, maybe twenty five for the whole package. Done. Word. Done okay. and done. I'll pay for it now. I do like Portal yeah. and Portal 2. Awesome games. Yeah, if only we could get Portal and Portal 2. Oh, that'd be great. For PlayStation VR. If only. Theater. 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 Are you theater. ready for the third trailer? I am yes. so ready for the third trailer. Fucking get yeah. ready to load it up. Yep. Beep. All right. Hold it back so you can stay in front of your mics. Medusa and Man. Right. Medusa and Man. I was just gonna say, is this a game about Michelle? <laughs> is that what it looks like when you're like standing up in, in the, the wind. wind? Yes. <laughs> Stereo. You guys are weird. <laughs> yeah. It's more fun that way. Getting ready to go in the hammock. <laughs> yeah. I like the Medusa hair. I do too. Yeah. Um, it flows just... nicely. I mean, this looks a little cheesy. Yeah, this looks pretty mm-hmm. rough, right? It's like when you go to the map in any PlayStation One RPG. Yep. All of a sudden, the graphics get like shit. She's wasting all her Medusa dreads. She is. She just throwing, they must regrow really quick. Very quick. <clears throat> like bats, and that's Link. 
<laughs> it's not Zelda. This is not a Zelda game. I think it just keeps blanking. I, I like I like that there's got to be like a button that just goes hair up, hair down. Yeah, really. Because that's what it looks it's like. like. It's flop, like flop, flop. Yeah. 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 I am thankful that they included this environment because I was like, do, do we just run around the In desert the, the whole sand, time? you know? Yeah. So is this that's a multiplayer, cool. like two-player game? Switch. One plays Medusa, one plays as Link. It I mean, looks not Link. very much like a two-player game, doesn't it? Yeah, because the way he ran around is like sporadic, like a human is controlling, not like PC. Right. But it, but it also looks like you're able to switch. Yes, it so, also. So the does. I'm betting the AI probably takes control so when you're not controlling the AI. Dual character control. I mean, All Medusa right. seems pretty basic when you're controlling her. It looks like you're like pew pew shooting and, you know. When he's swinging swords. So you, when when we see him, we seem to be in third person mode. Yeah. And then when we see her, we see her in third person and yeah. first person. Facing away because I can't look at. I think the premise is pretty neat. Is that is that Tried what the premise stone. is? That I don't know. Sense. That's, yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. 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 Did you turn to stone <laughs> if you look at Medusa? That was close. <laughs> real, real close. <laughs> um, you can't look at Medusa. So nope. yeah. All right. I can I, before we critique the game I want to critique the trailer that was a two minute trailer and it didn't show us it did it it, it had no right being a two minute trailer no no like, show, 30 show seconds someone. I would have been really impressed and been like look at all this game has to offer yeah. right. there's like hair going crazy there's deserts there's caves but yeah, after two minutes I'm characters. like taking bats down I don't yeah. know what's going on but after yeah. two minutes I'm like oh there's there's a whole lot of desert there's a whole lot of caves there and was, there was a whole yeah, like, lot of desert <laughs> there was a whole lot of there was. empty it a little boring on that, it did on say, that. Yeah. under development yeah. yeah so it's it's it was just maybe too early to give us a trailer yeah. and way too they were long too excited, of a trailer. You know? Maybe. Or, I or still maybe think that game still has potential. Some potential. Though, regardless. Yeah. If, if it's coming out next week, I'm like, uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. But right. if it's still got like <laughs> months or next year, right. all right. You know? yeah. A lot of people online were comparing it to Eco, which which makes me happy. It does visually kind of give that... I, it seems neat. Right. I like the whole premise, if that's what they're going for. Yeah, like you're you're alone with this other person kind of yeah. thing. Like this like empty, like barren world. Right. Yeah. You've got to help the other person survive kind of thing. Yep. I, I really like that. There, yeah. Like in Eco, there was a hand-holding button. Like yes. Held down like R1 or something <laughs> to, to, to oh, hold, yeah. hold Yorda's hand. Yeah. That? Yeah, I love that game. <laughs> it's <laughs> adorable. It? And, if it this is, and if this is going to be our VR Eco, then sign me up. 50 yeah. hours. Although I don't... 50? Hey, Holy so crap! Wow. VR Eco. Wow. <laughs> Although VR Eco, like with the actual going through the castle trying to find a way out, I mean, not running through a desert, though. That'd be old quick. You know? But yeah. Looks decent. Unless you can teleport. <laughs> no teleportation. teleportation. Ah, in <laughs> the desert. What the hell's going on here? Who knows? Uh, yeah, I just... I, I want to know more about this game. Mm -hmm. uh, and I, and I, and I, but I also want it soon. Like, it, it's something we don't have. Yeah. You know, I really enjoyed when when we saw her, uh, from her perspective, and she was mm -hmm. and she was taking down bats from a distance, yeah. and it was like almost Panzer Dragoon style, it was like you're, yeah. you're painting the, was, the enemies and cool. shooting out shooting the dreads, your snake hair, whatever they're called, dread yeah. snakes. Yeah, same it, thing. It's you. Same thing. It's, <laughs> it's <laughs> Michelle and Man. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so yeah, definitely a few different types of gameplay styles. Yeah. Uh, you know, just be able to run around as a dude and like you know swing your sword and stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, it's something we really don't have. Yeah. Um, and it. And I don't even mind the primitive look to it. As we all know, I'm a big fan of Marvels. Yeah. Marvels was a lot of oh, fun. Oh, we know. Oh, yeah. Oh, we know. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a big fan of Marvels, even though it doesn't look good. Games don't have to look perfect. No. Right? Mm -mm. Just give them to me. Yeah. For, for cheaper. <laughs> 39.99 if it looks like that. <laughs> so what do you think of the Medusa in Man? 19.99. Okay, I want this game to be huge and sprawling yeah. and amazing and full of magic like Eco. Yeah. Like, you know, the magical field, not, not like magic. If like, you say yeah, $50, yeah, yeah, yeah. I swear. Like $59.99. No. no. I want a boxed copy. I want it to be amazing. No. I want this to be two boxed years copy. out. Wow. I want this to come out in two more years when it's totally done and polished and awesome. The only, $60. The only <laughs> boxed version of this you're going to get is at a flea market. What is the <laughs> real, real number? <laughs> $12.99. $12.99? $12? Yeah, totally. sticking with 1999. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm with Michelle. Yeah, speaking of of 12.99 games, PlayStation VR games used to be cheaper. Yeah, yeah. Somebody, uh, there was some going out. Out. there was some <laughs> sales and stuff uh, recently, uh, which we'll talk about more tomorrow. But <clears throat> but uh, but I had to go back and look at some of the old uh, reviews I've done. And I had to go look at the prices for those games. Yeah, and like games like Crystal Rift, which I spent like probably like seven or eight hours in. Twelve ninety nine. I was like, "Wow, like, that's a 
bargain by today's cost. Yeah, really. Right? Yeah. Seven, eight hours, you'd be paying yeah, a premium. Pretty pricey. Yep. A little pricey for sure. Yep. All right. Is it time for the final, last uh, trail? Yes. Uh, I was trying to think of, an, uh, of a synonym for last or final. All I could think of was destination. That's not a, that's that's not a movie. <laughs> no final destination. Final destination. The first one decent. Then they just kept going. There was no final the, the, destination. The, the, Even the first the one was like, and, um, I thought it was decent was for what it was. Because you, like. you were 13 years old when yes, it came that's, out. Yes. That's why you thought it was great. That's true. Yeah, I haven't the, seen it since. You think the Wishmaster was good? Oh, my God. The Wishmaster. I haven't seen that in so long. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Wow. Really? Yeah. How about the people under the stairs? People on the stairs I saw once. Pretty bad. And I don't know how old I was. This is Brian Powell's. I watched Child Corner. Play 2 last night. So Child. good. <laughs> uh, all three of the first Child's Play movies are awesome. We just <laughs> got we just got HBO, so nice. and cable. So. Game of Thrones? Um, yeah. Just got cable out in the country. Yeah. Yeah, the cord runs now out that far. It wasn't even available now for all anyone I need, before that, was yeah. it? Like you didn't even have the option. In our <laughs> Australia friends, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, now all I need is a microwave and some AC. She's not kidding. <laughs> a microwave. Yeah, I need a microwave. Yeah. They're cheap. You can oh, get one oh, for like February. 80 bucks. Yeah. No, microwaves? Yeah. The one I have in the kitchen right now is like 40 bucks and it's the coolest one I've ever had. For real? It's also on the small side. Did yeah. you just say for real? I did. Yeah, you're fine. I fighting. did. I think I said it last week too. And come oh. February, I'm going to be the only one here. Rally you all right, or we Finally, Stop our that. last PlayStation <laughs> VR trailer is go. <coughs> what is it? Folia? Folia? Folia the something. Folia dear, dear father. father. Dear father. Dear father. You gotta say. Tell me. This looks way too good. Yeah. Look right. at how tight that looks. How tight that feels. I don't know yet. Mm. Yeah. Oh good. More flashlights on the ground. That's what we needed paranormal activity. Resident Evil-like? It does look very Resident Evil-like. <laughs> Extremely. The zoom Minus in on the, the objects. Light. I don't know. We needed to watch the flashlight he for that. He really one. wanted to check that thing out. Yeah. Oh, well, we have one. It now. works. And then you hear something and look. Flies. And trailer yeah. done. It's really short trailer. Yes. That actually told us a lot pretty quickly. <laughs> yeah. yeah. See, that's where they should take lessons. You know, maybe a little more than forty-three seconds, but yeah, not bad. I could have gone for another twenty seconds of that. Oh yeah, easily. Yeah. Uh, so. Really good looking game. Mm -hmm. I'm concerned it's not going to look this good in VR. Yeah, that looked really good. It looks good. really well made, yeah. Yeah, it looks very gory, too. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, yeah. look at, looking at that on like yep. a little uh, four inch phone screen, much yeah. different yeah. than seeing it firsthand. I right. think when we see that dude dead on the ground with all the blood around them, yeah. it's going to seem a little more visceral than yeah. staring mm -hmm. at it in 2D yeah. over here. Right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and also, the thing that got me initially, and the thing that like I, I didn't get to experience just now, is when they were walking around, mm -hmm. the sound of the floorboards yeah. was so oh, the loud and like creaks and yeah yeah. So like I like when I play Resident Evil Seven, I'm so scared to walk because I think that people well, you can get hear me. immersed in, immersed in it exactly. Yeah. So like I love when they make like sounds like that really loud and very like just like right there like almost something like you're scared in to your walk face. Yeah. yeah because it's so loud it makes you, you know, think like, they somebody's can hear gonna hear it. me someone's even gonna if hear they're me, not programmed yeah. to hear it you know yeah. it still right. makes you feel and I feel that might be a cheap way around it. Maybe right. you know, I did Makes watch you tiptoe through the house. <laughs> yeah, I did watch a couple of, uh, and I'm not even going to describe the YouTubers I watched play this game. Yeah, I watched uh, like a five or eight minute demo or something like mm -hmm. that. Dreamcast. Right? And uh, no, 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 I have no problem calling that dude out. <laughs> um, now th these also just as annoying. I have. I, are we? Listen, comment below. Are we? Do it. Are we annoying? Because because eh, it feels yeah. like every time I look something up <laughs> on YouTube, <laughs> every time I look something up on YouTube, it's like a bunch of people screaming and acting like uh, stupid. No, yeah. Right? Why are you trying to sell me a car? <laughs> <laughs> so I watched two guys um, basically screaming as they're playing this game, like yeah. yelling at each other, screaming. And I'm like, like this oh is god, it's like your movie obnoxious. theater incident. It's exactly. Ah. What I was thinking. <laughs> That's it's exactly what I was thinking, and I was just like, guys, can can you can you shut up? I thought you were trying to show us this game and demonstrate it. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, and it was just obnoxious. That um, sucks. Yeah, and so uh, so if if we're also very annoying, I, I apologize. That was mm. not the intention of the show. The intention of the show and the channel actually just sidetrack. I wanted to create a channel that I wanted to watch where there wasn't screaming and there wasn't all this annoying right. stuff. Wow, because it seems like there's so few of them. Fun with yeah. a little bit of news. <laughs> yeah, like I'm too old yeah, for this yeah. stuff. Right. right? Yeah. Oh, hey, mm. that was the last trailer. 
Oh, it was. shit, it was. All right, so here's the deal. What we need you to do is comment down below. Tell us if we're annoying. But then also tell us uh, what PlayStation VR uh, trailers you'd like us yes. to watch on next week's PlayStation hold VR. Hold on, hold on. What do, we, what do we price this at? Oh, this dear God, you're psychological right. Psychological horror. Survival horror. Twenty nine ninety nine. That's what you're thinking? That's yeah. what I'm thinking. I'm feeling in the 20s, but... Michelle, twenty nine ninety nine is in the twenties. If you were unaware, sir, absolutely. Would you like thirty four ninety nine? Would you like to reference thirty <laughs> four? Yeah, the math I'm thinking, podcast. No, no. <laughs> I'm thinking about twenty four ninety nine. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I'm feeling. So it's gonna be like fifty bucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You yeah, really need to start writing off. down what we all say. And we do, save but we'll that. never. If check. only there was some sort of record <laughs> of everything Any- we said during the show <laughs> forever until uh, the world ends. Basically, I wonder. I wonder are there, no. any, are there any loyal game cats? <laughs> wow. Yeah, it, dude. Are there any loyal game cats that want to oh, go back God. and check all of our pricing? Wow. I think well, we should sit here. said we're always wrong. We should I sit here as a group and, and, and totally go back and price understand. everything. Actually price them out. Because we didn't price everything from the beginning. No, we didn't. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yep. We won't okay. do it. No, we won't. All right. We love you all. <laughs> yes. <laughs> all right. Uh, stay tuned yep. for uh, tomorrow, PlayStation. No, nope, that's not it. Uh, viewer drums. Takeover, where we yes. let you, the loyal game cats, take over the show. Yeah. We read your comments and all that kind of stuff, but you know how it works. You'll be back tomorrow, and so will we. Yeah. We will. I'm Brian. That's Jeremy. This is Michelle. And we'll see you. Tomorrow. We'll see ya. We'll just see you. Yeah. We'll just yeah. see you around. Good comments. People mm. have been Good really comments. positive lately. Yeah. And the, pe- and the people who haven't been positive, the Game Cats took Muted. care of. <laughs> yeah, oh, they just Yeah, fire. total thanks to the Game Cats, by the yeah. way. They defend. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, well, this, awesome. this can be bonus material. <clears throat> Shout out to the loyal Game Cats. Defended <laughs> our girl here. Yes, In very the- much so. Thank you. Yep. That was awesome. <laughs> yeah. And then we muted him, and it was even more awesome. Before, yeah, before I even no got to the comments. No one will ever know. <laughs> <laughs> Except for him, if he's watching, probably not. Nah. Before I even yeah. got to the comments, I was like, I was like, oh, crap, what did I miss? And it was like this whole discussion going on, and it wasn't nice, and I was just like, yeah. mute. Take care of that. Yeah. Fuck that. Uh, but I'm glad that they were there to defend you. They defended the my honor. They right. did. They did. Yeah. I like that. <laughs>